work out one fifth, add three quarters. Now, in order to add together two fractions, we have to have the same denominator. All that means is that the bottom number of both fractions needs to be the same before we can add them together. So what I'm looking for here is a number that is in both the five and the four times table. This is known as the lowest common multiple of five and four. Now, in this case, I'm going to change both fractions here to have a denominator of 20. 20 is the lowest number in both the five and the four times tables. Now, in order to get from five to 20, we have multiplied by four. And so we are going to do exactly the same with the numerator of that fraction. One multiplied by four gives us four. Then to get from four to 20, we have multiplied by five. And so we are going to do exactly the same with the numerator of that fraction. Three multiplied by five gives us 15. Once we get to this point, we can just add the numerators together. The denominator stays the same. 4 plus 15 gives us 19, and my denominator stays as 20. So 1 fifth plus 3 quarters gives us an answer of 19 over 20.